Alright, so I was not expecting to make this video today, but I'm going to be making it because the live event has officially been confirmed. Yes, after days of speculation, the live event has been confirmed, and there's even a countdown inside of the game. Look at that, it says 9 days and 9 hours and 18 minutes and 40 seconds remaining until it is done. And yes, there's a lot to go over in this video because there's even a trailer, a lot of info about it, and even some really good theories that I'm going to be going over in today's video. So before we jump right into it, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe because it really helps me out a lot. Anyway, let's go ahead and just dive right into it. So here's a tweet right over here and Asimo says there's over 2,000 likes in just a few hours so it's very very popular. Anyway, it says over here, save the date. Players of hashtag Roblox, we have an epic live event coming very soon to Jailbreak to celebrate five years. You won't want to miss it. Join us Saturday, April 2nd, 2022 at 10 a.m. PST or 1 p.m. EST or 5 p.m. GMT. And here's our trailer, which we're going to be watching on YouTube because there's more higher quality. Okay, so here it is on YouTube. So let me go ahead and play it. I'm going to be narrating through it. There's a lot to go over, but I'm going to play it one time and then I'm going to like stop and just replay it again, but I'll be explaining everything. So here we go. Let's go ahead and play it. So there's also some like subtitles, I guess. What will we do? Asimo says. And look at that. That's easy walking out the donut shop. Yeah. Um, Asimo walking out of the gas station. You hear sort of some air raid sirens and stuff. Quite interesting. A jailbreak live event. You get that air raid siren again. And uh, Asimo talking to Bad CC. And look at that. There you go. I think that's about it. Yeah, look at that. Live event. Join us April 2nd. And cool. Alright, so we're going to start from the very beginning and we're going to be going right here. So it starts off with Simo saying, what will we do? And if you guys didn't even notice that, there's actually a shooting star in the background. As you can see, look at that. I think it's very obvious. And then, of course, uh, Bad CC runs out of the donut shop. Asimo runs out of the gas station. They're all running away. And as you can see, 5th anniversary, jailbreak. And there's Asimo sort of like freaking out or something. And a Bad CC also freaking out. There's also another shooting star right over here, as you can see. You can see right there, there's a shooting star. And it's also nighttime in jailbreak. And, um, yeah, Simo and Bad CC are literally, like, freaking out on the control tower over here. And it says, uh, let's see. I wish I could tell you more. And then, uh, Bad CC says, hey, Asimo, what are we going to do? And then, uh, go ahead and run. Anyway, I'm right over here at the control tower. And I believe this is, like, where the location is taking place at. So, let's just go ahead and head inside of here if we can. All right, here it is. This is sort of, like, the location of where it is. Now, obviously, it does look a little bit different. I mean, obviously, this is a live event, right? So, yeah, it looks like the control tower has been updated, but they're in some sort of tower up above. We're going to be assuming the airport. Obviously, it looks like the airport because, you know, there's all the windows out there and there's computers. Doesn't look like the one right over here, though, but, you know, it's pretty similar to that. I'm assuming that they have, like, sort of revamped the airport or something, but people are thinking of that at the airport, so, yeah. Anyway, one thing people are saying everyone has missed is the very side has like 4, 4, and 20. You know, that's April 4th, 2020. And, uh, you know, I believe that's just a mistake on Asimo's end because this looks like the same animation he used for the 2020 live event. So, yeah, I don't think there's exactly something that's missing. However, to be honest, I've watched this so many times and I don't see anything secret in here, like sort of any like secret code or anything. But one thing that's very interesting I want to point out over here is, of course, Asimo says over here, jailbreak is it's in trouble. And, and at this time, it's not the aliens, obviously referring to the alien invasion about like a few years ago. And uh, at the very end, it's quite strange because uh, Asimo says better run because there seems to be something that just happens. But then, you know, there's a cut screen. And as you can see, Asimo like sort of just like cuts the screen right there. And there's just black screen right over here. And nothing else because, you know, ends off on a cliffhanger. I like it. But yeah, it is a very dramatic turn of events. But anyway, let me go ahead and show you some tweets from Asimo and everything he has confirmed so far. So the first thing is someone asked over here if there's going to be a reward if people attend the event. And Asimo says yes. So if you attend this event, you're going to get some special rewards. So it's going to be very interesting. Secondly, for the people who can't make it, well, I have my video, so you guys can watch my video, obviously. But Asimo will have replays available for people. So yeah. Next up, a lot of the stuff is going to be a secret. It'll be a complete secret. And there may be some like season leaks next week, but, but nothing about the live event, which is great because people can speculate and stuff. And if you do have any speculation, let me know in the comment section. Tell me what you guys think. 
Now, that's everything you know about the trailer. Now, I've watched the trailer like many, many, many times, and I gotta say, I haven't found anything, you know, like some secret code inside of there. Nothing like that. I mean, we've brightened everything up. There, there isn't anything too much of a secret in there. Now, I'm assuming that Simo might at least like more trailers or something, but I think it's actually really good to look back at when Jailbreak was actually having the previous live event, because when Jailbreak had a live event, well, before a live event, that's way back and before April 2020, there was actually no map expansion so one thing one theory that people are saying is that the next update well the live event obviously is going to bring a huge map expansion to jailbreak and as you guys do know the live event of 2020 brought this huge map expansion now basically expanded the map by creating oceans and stuff but also you know made the map sort of like jailbreak is now on an island rather than sort of like on a floating island in the middle of nowhere there's actually you know oceans and stuff it was actually just some floating piece of rock in the middle of the void but you know now it's no longer that it's like a huge island which is great i like it now jailbreak has expanded all the way this way like this way has been mainly the direction of jailbreak expansion but over toward the prison there has been no expansion at all and some people are bringing the stuff up that the shooting stars are facing this direction a lot and also there used to be duct tape right over here at this tunnel right over here there used to be some duct tape and uh, now it's gone so that's pretty interesting so some people think that this will have a map expansion toward the prison there might be more stuff over here um for the update now, I believe this is a pretty logical theory because obviously there were duct tape over here and Asimo did mention about a map expansion last year when he was doing a Q&A and stuff, but he didn't talk into too many details, but he did hint that there may be a map expansion. Now, this is another theory and it's from Jailbreak DeLorean Dude and it's actually really, really viable, at least in my opinion, because he says it's the chickens and if you guys don't know what that means, it is this thing. And for people who didn't play the Ready Player One event, which was in 2018, you probably wouldn't know what this is. Take a look at this. So basically, uh, if you crash on this yellow wall right over here, uh, you would actually get greeted by like a chicken or something. And people are thinking that this might be having a return. Because if you guys didn't know, a Simo said over here, uh, and this time it is not the aliens in the 2022 live event trailer. In the trailer, a Simo literally said it wouldn't be aliens. So that sort of just rules out an alien invasion as a theory because you know Simo literally says and this time it's not the alien so it's imaginably something worse than the alien something worse has happened to jailbreak than the aliens and um that brings us to our next theory so as you guys do know there are shooting stars up in the sky well obviously um it's raining so you can't really see it so let me just turn off the rain over here so you can kind of see the shooting stars it's still oh my goodness so yeah there should be shooting stars at night time if you look up in the sky there should be shooting stars of course when it's raining you're not really going to see shooting stars because you know there's clouds up in the sky but look at that shooting stars right over there headed in that direction over there and some people are saying you know shooting stars are basically asteroids or meteors and stuff and jailbreak does actually have a meteor and it's right over here at the Area 51 base. Of course, it has not been really used or anything, and there's no more fuel out of it anymore. It used to be covered in like purple rocket fuel, but you know, it's not that anymore because you know, we're using it in jailbreak and stuff. So, some people are thinking that there may be a huge meteor attack in jailbreak, which I also do think it's very viable as an option as well because you know, there's literally shooting stars coming down from the sky. So, I think that makes sense a lot. I also want to point out the jailbreak live event two years ago. I actually do have a play so if you guys want to watch it it will obviously be in the end screen of the video or the description so go check it out but yeah you can see the entire replay here it is pretty cool but i want you guys to know that basically there was a nuke obviously there was no nuke in jailbreak and that basically introduced nukes to jailbreak there was also some like huge tornado and a disaster well you know hurricane actually there's a hurricane and tornado at the same time as a flood so there's a huge natural disaster and after the huge natural disaster the jailbreak map was uh, basically flooded and stuff and then there is the huge new map which is really really cool so i just want to let you guys do know that but uh yeah this time it's gonna be definitely a lot more than that and also this entire like live event was like 10 minutes long so it's like a 10 minute long live event so it was actually a pretty long live event it was really really fun and i think jailbreak hit like a peak of 550,000 players so it was pretty insane anyway tell me what you guys think about it if you have any theories let me know down below in the comment section i would love to hear from you guys if you do have any theories about this live event now obviously if there's going to be any comment that says alien um you guys make sure to react to that comment just like say like no that there's not gonna be no aliens as he literally said no aliens it's gonna be worse than aliens 
aliens. So don't expect aliens this update, obviously. I keep on saying update, I meant live event. So don't expect an alien this live event. So it's gonna be something worse than aliens. No, okay, well, Asimo didn't really rule out aliens, but you know, I don't think it's gonna be aliens. He, he literally said it in the live event. But yeah, tell me what you guys think down below. And yeah, I'll catch you if there's more like leaks or some stuff. I'll make a video, but yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. And uh, yeah, bye. Oh,